Hello, my friends. Whoa, what is, I guess the wind blew my hair up. What is going on? How long has that been like that? Well, yeah, we just went to the mall for the first time in, how long has it been? Yeah, you can watch your show. Oh, but we haven't done school yet. Oh, yeah. Can it be educational? I had some Pokemon. concealer on here, but apparently the mask took that off. Anyway, hi. Yeah, I didn't really film too much in the mall. Our main mission was to use our $5 credit. If you're going to watch Pokemon before you do school, then you have to not complain at all about school. If you just do it, if it's hard, say, this is hard, can you help me? Instead of, I can't do this. Boom, 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 boom. Okay? Yeah. You're gonna be good? Okay, go ahead. Quietly. See, I didn't feel much because we were just on a mission. I'm gonna put you on the oven for a second. So, you sit there. We went to GameStop to get, to use up Jax's $5 credit. Technically it's mine, I have the membership, but obviously it's for him. But, Instead of getting an eShop credit like normal, he decided he's going to use some of his birthday and Christmas money and he got a Pokemon game, the newest one, and used the $5 as well. Alright. Ooh, I'm sorry, that was probably really loud in your ear. Let's take this before I melt my phone. I'm going to make some hot toast. Yeah, so now we're back. We didn't do kindergarten yet. Jax is gotten a lot of his schoolwork done because we took off Monday whenever I remove one day from our schedule it recalculates the week and takes so much out I'm like you didn't need to take that much out now all the days are light but he's happy about it and we're able to do our mall day tomorrow I'm hoping we have a break in the weather so we can go to Starbucks because that'll probably be our last time going to our Starbucks before they close in a few days so that's a huge bummer I just made myself coffee. Can you tell I'm cold? Yesterday got up to 74. Is that in the 20s Celsius? Here it is. And today, oh, there's birdies. Oh, they're so cute. I'll try and get them in a second. Now it is 30 and cold rain and about to turn to snow flurries. Let me show you these birdies before. Oh, they flew away. They were in that bush right there. Anyway, that's my update. I'm kind of like dreading hearing phone calls from those schools, to be honest, because I just left a big blank spot in previous school. Sebastian has nothing, but I didn't put Jax's most recent test results in the transcript section of uh, his school history. So I don't know. I don't know what they're gonna think. Yeah. That's my life, and I will see you later.
ready, but I am missing my little friend. He is downstairs in the basement, laying on the floor watching Pokemon on his lap, his laptop, his iPad. <laughs> I was like, you need to say goodnight to your dad and come upstairs, but I have a feeling he's still in the same spot. And my husband's down there, <laughs> probably absorbed in what he's doing. The site is pretty much done, but he's got to minify it and run, make a script to minify it so it loads faster, so there's that. Anyway, I feel like we spoke, but again, I don't remember when or what. I believe we talked about, I talked to you before quiet time, I think, but yeah. So we did quiet time after lunch, and it was just normal. And then we went downstairs, and I did some practice on my iPad. I got pro Procreate, bleh, bleh, Procreate for painting because I already have Illustrator for my vector art. I've been practicing that too. But starting to get used to the interface and yeah, just practice. So Sebastian ended up joining me and painting an eyeball too. I always like to start out with an eyeball. It's just, they're so pretty. I wasn't looking at anything, I was just drawing one. And then we ordered burgers, so that's pretty fast. Probably a bad decision, because it bloated me up so bad that my stomach hurts, because I get a bean burger. <laughs> and even the beano is not good enough to help me digest that comfortably, but it'll pass, literally. <laughs> and yeah, we ate. Then I took a bath because the temperature dropped and I'm cold. It's pouring out there, but it's just been hovering just above freezing. We are in an ice warning though here because it's going to dip under freezing overnight and we could have a very slippery roads. But I'm hopeful that midday after school, we can go over to our local Starbucks because in a few days it will be closed permanently. <laughs> breaking my heart. We've been going there since Jax was a newborn. So we need to go at least one more time and I don't want to go on the weekend because there's only one table outside. So yeah, hopefully we can do that. It can warm up enough. I think it's supposed to get up to 50, which is way warmer than today. But then after my bath, I heard back from a friend who recently lost his beloved 14 year old snake. I'm heartbroken for him. I have a friend who had a snake for so many years and he's still sad about her passing years later. She was so special to him. So I know he's probably hurting from that. And I don't have any new paintings to do yet. Nobody wants to pay yet. Nobody wants to order one. So. I figure it's good use of my time to keep building my portfolio and I don't have a beautiful reptile yet so I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to the geometry of the scales and it's almost like tone on tone. It's a very natural, simple color palette so it'll be interesting to just work with those colors and mix up a million shades of them. I don't really mix up stuff too much. I kind of dip in all the colors and just mix it on the brush. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. So I had about 45 minutes. So I sketched out beautiful Cassie the snake and painted the background first coat. So just like basic, just brown and black. There'll be areas of dark shadow, but then brown wood chips, I believe. So I got that set, realized my time lapse was not a time lapse, but a 34 minute video. Oops. <laughs> and I swear I looked around at my camera and I thought it was set to the right thing, but it wasn't. Come on, man, you gotta get ready. And <laughs> mommy's always here. And yeah, so I ended up, like if I just speed it up in iMovie, it only does double speed so that only made it 17 yeah. inches, inches I'm trying to um, talk while he's talking at me so 
it can only shorten it to 17 minutes because it was like 30 something. So I ran it through three times to get it down to four minutes, which means if I speed it up as fast as I can in this actual video that you just watched, it was probably about two minutes. So that's what I'll do in the future when I accidentally make these long ass videos that were supposed to be time lapses that were 23 seconds. Anyway, Mr. Braddy McBradderson is there messing up the bed that I just made instead of changing. Look at this. What did you just do? Why is it all on the floor? Get off my clothes. You're hairy. <laughs> All right, guys. I am just gonna say good night. No, I don't want you to stay on that furniture at all. I want you to get changed. And don't forget about your hairy pants here. Come join me to say good night. Friends, I will see you tomorrow. It is Friday tomorrow. Friday tomorrow. Every time I do my dealing a lesson on Friday, it gives me this little blue gem option that I skip, but it always reminds me that it's Friday and I start thinking it's the most wonderful day of the week, <laughs> right? Oh, I meant to say, I got an email from the middle school, just from the registrar saying, we have received your pre-registration. We deal with all that in April, so we'll talk to you then. Reach out if you have any questions. So one down and I don't have to talk to them till April, though I might email them. All right, now back to saying good night and goodbye. <laughs> Friends, good night, goodbye. Stay safe, be kind, and don't forget. Ooh, wash your hands.